the manual muscle testing mmt testing muscle strength is important during assessment of certain conditions whose effect may involve the muscular system physiotherapists need to assess muscle strength which is normally stated in folders as muscle power in order to determine the abilities and inabilities of the patient this video is going to give a theory of the manual muscle testing the manual muscle testing is a manual technique used to determine the extent of muscle imbalance muscle length and strength examined before exercise intervention muscle strength testing checks the ability of the individual muscles or muscle groups to function in movement and provide stability and support before this manual muscle testing is done Patients should be positioned such that muscles to be tested can move against gravity. If patients cannot do this, then let them try moving a transverse plane where there is little to no gravity resisting their movement. Now let's look at how we can do the grading after our manual muscle testing. The grading would either be zero. 1, 2 minus, 2, 2 plus, 3 minus, 3, 3 plus, 4, and 5. Now, each of these numbers I mentioned has its own explanation, and that will give you what specific number you are to give if you perform the manual muscle testing. And even we have remarks given to each of them except zero now with a one remarks that you can give is trace with a two minus four two four two plus four three minus fair three fair three plus fair four good five normal now each of these numbers has its own explanation and goes like this zero value represents no visible or palpable muscle contraction during your assessment the one value also represents only visible or palpable muscle contraction without joint motion during your assessment two minus represents incomplete movement performed in transverse plane without gravity. Two represents complete or full movement performed in transverse plane without gravity. Two plus means ability to initiate movement up to halfway against gravity. Three minus represent inability to complete movement against gravity or inability to hold test position also three plus represent ability to perform full movement against gravity and can hold the test position against light resistance four represents ability to perform full movement against gravity and can still hold the test position against moderate resistance. A five value, which happens to be the last value, represents ability to perform full movement against gravity and can hold the test position against maximum resistance. <laughs> wow, so that was a nice presentation from PT Thomas. Kindly subscribe to this channel if you are a new member and don't forget to share to your colleagues to us who enjoy from this very channel have a nice day bye